Hi, this is Stacy with Better Business Together, where we energetically help your business get there. And today's online lead tip is for the real estate industry, and it's talking about handling sold properties. What to say to that prospective buyer to get them to go forward with you in the next step in purchasing a property. So the one of the most common mistakes agents make when working with online leads is that if the property is sold, that's the first thing they say after their name. So they might say, um, I'm so sorry, the property you're calling about it has been sold, but I can talk about other properties. Oftentimes, um, more oftentimes than not, actually, the buyer is going to say, oh, no, thank you. No, thank you. And they're going to hang up. And that is going to be a lost lead. However, if you nurture it and build the rapport and ask the buyer what they saw in the photos first that appealed to this property, it gives the buyer an opportunity to talk to you about why they liked that property, what was important to them, and then you can start discussing and looking up comparable suitable homes. So many top agents across the United States, and especially many of our successful real estate clients, state that something like this, and so hopefully this line will help you and you can make it your own, of course. So many times they say, you know, there are about three or four similar homes that have a lot of the things that you're looking for. What would be a good time to look at these similar homes? Does seven o'clock tonight work? Does 915 tomorrow work? And I'll try and set these showings quickly and get back with you. That's just one of the many ways that we're going to be talking about how to be successful with using real estate online leads. If you need additional tips or if you have a real estate company that you would like some online lead source help, please visit us at betterbusinesstogether.com. I'm Stacy with your tip of the day.